Hi guys, welcome to my channel. We're going to be watching How to Get Away with Murder Season 4, Episode 15. This one's called No One Else is Dying, something like that. Um, this is the season finale for Season 4, so I am very excited to get into this, even though I may not look like I'm excited because I'm really tired. And I'm cold, so I have a blanket because it's cold down here in the basement. Um, but I really am looking forward to this. Um, things are kind of going a little bit crazy um, with Laurel and her mom. Laurel was confronting her mom about Wes and and everything and wants to know why her mom killed Wes and her mom says she didn't kill Wes and I don't know who killed Wes. I don't know if Wes is even dead. I I don't know. There's just so many questions and maybe this isn't a good time for me to react because I'm tired and my brain's not going to function correctly. But uh, if I don't record, I'm going to fall asleep and I can't do that because... Uh, I have to go pick up my kid from school in a couple hours. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, I can't, I can't do that. Um, but yeah, so anyway, if you guys would like to follow me on Twitter, would like to get early access to my reactions, and would like to watch the full reactions over on my Patreon, links are down below. Let's get into this episode. It's oh yeah, Denver. Bonnie might be dead. I totally forgot sounds. about that. She's at it again. Well, if you don't handle it, I will. What, does he think it's Laurel? What a twist it would be if the dead person is actually Denver. Like, he got rid of him, of him instead of Bonnie. You think it foul play? Where the hell you been? I've been calling you nonstop. My phone died. What's wrong? <laughs> Poor Asher. Why does this keep happening to us? The scene has multiple displaced fractures and dislocations. That the district right attorney's humerus, office could be either one, femur. Bonnie or Denver. I'm gonna find the drive. How the FBI's could be all over this. Be careful. I think it's Denver. Just don't do anything stupid. Well, you're next. It was Jorge, right? He's been tracking all of our calls, and he heard me leave you that voicemail. God knows. Annalise, I know who has the drive. It's Denver. Yes! He's playing both sides. Much better. Good riddance. Very happy right now. Where have you been? I slept at Colliver's. Oh, Can we please this just talk? Cutie calls I'm it Colliver's. You. I'm not asking you to. I just want you to at least hear why I did what I did. You did it because you're an evil person. You get to feel that way, yes, but we can't afford to turn on each other, especially with all this Denver stuff happening. I'm not writing you out to the police. I'm just moving out. Just stop packing and look me in the eye, please. We are over, Michaela. Get over it. I am deeply, deeply sorry. That's what I'm saying. Again, you're saying that because you think you're supposed to say that, but you don't mean it. You don't regret it. Of course I do. You don't know yourself, Michaela. That's the big aha for me here, is I get you more than you get you. And yes, I fell in love with you, every part of you, especially your ambition. But I made the mistake of thinking that that ambition stopped in the bedroom. So just own who you are. A backstabbing, power-hungry, social climbing... Don't you dare call me a bitch. You said it for me. All right, don't feel bad for you, Michaela. I'm with Asher, 100%. Annalise? Is she okay? I'm fine. We all are. Until Laurel's parents blew up this hotel. They're not terrorists. They blew up Annalise's house with Wes inside. No one else is dying. Now, as screwed up as it sounds, all we have is each other. And so we have to work to protect each other. And that's what we're going to do. Hi. Where is she? What? Your mother's missing, Laurel. The last person she was seen with at the hotel was you. You're lying. None of my people can find her. You're probably with her right now. I'm with your son. Why are you there? To remind you what's at stake here. I am coming there. I'm not letting my grandson get sucked into some cult. You are the person I am trying to protect him from. Just tell me where your mother is, and everyone will stay safe. I don't know where she is. Did you do something to her? I don't know. No, maybe. of course not. Tell me the truth, Laurel. Did you hurt your mother? Tell me or I'll take this boy away for good. I didn't do anything. Tell me the truth, Laurel. Tell me. Tell me. 
she's probably on a plane to Paris, passed out on Xanax and wine. Wish she took a nosedive into the Hudson. Then great, one of our problems is solved. Saying things like that makes me think you did something to her. I said terrible things to her, yes, but I'm not an animal. I would never hurt my own mother. What did you say to her? Things that she deserved to hear. Like? I told her to kill herself. They're just words. Said to a woman with mental health yeah. issues. Yeah. This is what my father does. He wanted you to start doubting me. Look, it's working. Laurel's his mother, and although I agree she has some impulse control issues... She's not the only one. Okay, now is not the time to do this. <laughs> oh, so you want to talk about impulse control issues? You mean yours? Because it seems like you can't seem to help yourself from jumping what about you running over and killing someone? What about you someone? your stupid guerrilla rage, like when you ran over Sinclair? Look, I'm sorry we've had our beef in the past. But I can't fill Denver's shoes without some help from people like you. So can we just bury the hatchet? Be friends? I don't trust of this course. guy. It means she's gonna get you whistleblower protections and your visa. I want him out. What? Leave. I know this is a lot, but I'm on your side. Sam has been through enough, Oliver. Let's just give him what he needs. Do you really blame him, Oliver? You lied to him about liking him and he really liked you. The Gallivan case has been closed for a decade. I know, I worked it back when I was a detective. The feds just want us to look into Denver's old cases, find anyone with a grudge. I think the drive's in there. If it makes sense, it'd be in there. It's an old case, right? It's a lost student. But he really just wanted to talk about my father. Your father? I was just as surprised as you. I didn't even know they knew each other. How did they? I don't know, but Denver asked me if I'd spoken to him recently. I haven't, obviously, due to the custody stuff. C custody of who? You told him everything? Just the things that'll make them investigate my father. How does sticking the FBI on him make any sense? Seriously, just threaten his own grandchild. Imagine the Goodfellas massacre he'll do to us. Think for a second instead of panicking. This lays the groundwork for Simon to blow the whistle on Antares. That's only true if we have the hard drive. Speaking of, you really need to go talk to Simon. Michaela knows what she's doing. Please be Nate with the hard drive. Hey. Nate. What is it? That's Dominic's phone. I gave it to Denver in our last meeting. No hard drive. Probably because the FBI already has it. Wait. You looking for this too? Finally, Nate, good for something. Why aren't we handing the drive? I gave you a shout out on the steps of the Supreme Court. And I'm grateful for that. I didn't do it to validate you. I did it so you can get your ass back into law school. What are you implying? I'm not implying anything. I just know what really happened. Huh? How? Because I know he... everything. What happened? Did he flunk out? Did he... I'm confused. Tell Annalise I want to see my deal and prove that there's any illegal files or I will tell the police what really happened that night. That would be a very big mistake. <laughs> yeah, Michaela's kind of doesn't Michaela have anything to lose right now, so I really wouldn't fuck with her. Suffocate him and then maybe Change of plans. No, just give me a few more minutes. This is a time that we ask for help, Laurel. Who are you gonna ask for help? Oh, Tegan? Really? Even if your ludicrous claims were true, I am one of Jorge Castillo's lawyers. Attorney-client privilege only applies to past crimes. But since your client's crimes are ongoing, Enough. you could be arrested with him and charges his co-conspirator. So why not jump ship? Be the whistleblower. I'm calling security. They killed the district attorney. This is not worth dying for. Get the hell out of my office. I mean, that's why she doesn't want to say anything, because if she does, she might die. Denver was keeping files on all of you. I know. I found them. Where are they? I destroyed them already. No, he didn't. I don't think he destroyed them. Did you know how to shut him up? They call ICE. No. He brought an illegally obtained gun to a workplace. That's grounds for deportation. We are not deporting a gay man back to Pakistan. That's not who we are. Of course it is. Do you want to destroy an innocent life? Do you know what that means, not just for Simon, but for you? I more than understand guilt at this point. Talk to me if you start drinking a bottle of vodka at night and fantasizing about ways to off yourself. I'm trying to save us. Save yourself is what I'm telling you. Because the path you're on nearly killed me, and you're not me. 
You know I love you no matter what, right? What are you asking me? Am I looking for something I'm not gonna find? You say you love me. I just need to ask. I told you no. I'm not the sociopath here. That's you. I don't know. You were pretty angry. But I didn't drop out either. I failed out. And I know it's stupid that I didn't tell you. I just, I was ashamed. And now I'm ashamed that I was ashamed. Do you want to call off the wedding? <sighs> Shut up. We have the hard drive. Where's my daughter? I'm not here to negotiate a family reunion. Sign this. It recants your testimony against Laurel. The judge will be swayed and give her sole custody. Then we can all move on. You bring out the worst in people, don't you? Yes. Always Annalise's fault people do bad things. That was me being sarcastic, if you couldn't tell. You want to call this off? Okay, well, you know, don't do it. Let the FBI find whatever's on this. You wouldn't have come here. She looks like she's about to smother Simon in his sleep. No, you can't.